Lord, I said, yeah. the Father, this is real. Will you watch over me? Will you raise him up to be strong? I don't, I, I'm just a man with flesh. This is what you call for in your scriptures. You said they wore studs and fringes, they got it on. You said they are follow the law, they doing it. You said under your house shine, they ought to love one another. Are they doing it?
am he. God is saying, I even I am he. This is God speaking. Go ahead. And there is no God with me. Guess what? There is no God with me. All these gods and ideas and philosophies you have don't exist to God, man. All of it is useless. The Anunnaki, all that nonsense is garbage, man. There's no God with him. Go ahead. I kill. I what? I kill. Who's speaking? This is God speaking. Listen to this good black man. God is saying this. Read it again. I kill. God kills. And I make a lie. And he makes a lie, man. That's the God of the Bible. This is a God that we in the Christian church, we never met in the Christian church. The Christian church hid this God from us because he's too harsh. You know why? With this God, there's accountability. With this God, there's penalty. And the God of the Christian church, he's good all the time. It doesn't matter what you do. But this guy here, what, he does, what does he do? I kill. He what? I kill. And I make a lie. If somebody died, God allowed it. God authorized it. Nothing happens without God's authority. People think God is weak and things are happening and he can't control it. No, he knows what's happening. He approves it. He kills and he makes it alive. If a baby is born, it's by God's uh, mercy. If somebody is unalived, it's because God allowed it. That's how this God works, man. Read more. I wound. I what? I wound. God is good all the time. I wound. God is loves everybody. I wound. God wounds. What it means to wound? To injure. Think disease, plagues, sickness, car accidents, car crashes, plane crashes. I what? I wound. God wounds. Go ahead. And I heal. And he heals. What does that mean? If he kills and he makes a laugh and he wounds and he heals, guess what? You better hope he, he, he's on your side. You better hope he shows you mercy. Why? Because he controls everything, man. People think these things are just happening with, with no with no control. God controls everything, man. Give me Jeremiah chapter 4, verse 22. You understand know I me? Mean? The problem is we've never been introduced to this God. If we if we were ever introduced to this God, our lives would be completely different. Why? Because we know there's penalty. We think before we act because we know there's penalty, man. But since the Christian church is good all the time, then it doesn't matter what you do. You know what I mean? Give me Jer Jeremiah chapter 4, verse 22. Go ahead. Jeremiah chapter 4 verse 22 For my people is foolish My what? For my people Who's his people? That's possessive Who's his people? Not everybody Read it again For my people Blacks, Hispanics, Native American Indians man You black men in Baltimore man You are God's people But what did God say about you? For my people is foolish What? Is foolish yeah. They, they have not known me. They have what? They have not known me. This is God saying you don't know him, man. You say you know God. God is saying, no, you don't know me. Based on how you live, based on how you carry yourselves, based on how we treat each other, we don't know God. You understand? Read it again. Jeremiah chapter 4, verse 22. For my people is foolish. They have not known me. We have not known God. Go ahead. They are sottish children. You know what? They are sottish children. Sottish children. What does, what does the word sottish mean? It means foolish, but in the sense where you're drunk. You're stumbling. You're drunk. You don't even know where you're at. You don't know where you're at. Imagine, imagine, imagine as a man, your father turns around and says, you don't know me. Meaning what? What does it mean you don't know your father? You don't know his judgment, man. You don't know how he carries himself. You don't know how he runs this house. That's why you're coming in and say, well, God is good all the time, therefore I could pimp my sisters, I could sell drugs, God is good all the time. But one more time from the top, what? For my people is foolish. They have not known me. They are sottish children. They are sottish children, black man. It's time we stop being sottish children here, man. Come and find out who you are. So that we can know who God is and we'll act accordingly, man, and serve him the right way. And he'll destroy our enemies before us, man. Once again, we are the ISUPK under command of Jan Still at 1 West 125th Street Hall, New York. Teaching blacks, Hispanics, Native American Indians that you are the real Jews, man. You are the real Jews. And World War Three is about to happen. Over you, black man.
Yeah. Babylon is falling. Yeah.